The lone pilot who died this morning when his helicopter crashed into a crane in London has been named as Captain Pete Barnes. He was 50 years old and, according to the Daily Telegraph, had over 25 years of flying experience, with countless TV, film and sporting credits to his name escorting aerial film crews. He'd apparently asked for permission to land at nearby London heliport in Battersea because of bad weather. Another person died at the scene and 12 more are being treated in hospital after the incident this morning which saw the chopper hit a crane on top of a building site and smash to the floor on Wandsworth Road and then explode. I was working maybe 100 metres from the building and we heard a big bang at about half eight this morning, looked up and uh, saw the helicopter in the sky crashing out of control coming down and went behind a block of flats and we just saw a big flame ball, smoke, everything, cars landed, there's an engine next to a car that was on fire, um, everything was just manic, flames, fire, everything. Metropolitan Police Commander Neil Basu said it was miraculous the crash wasn't much worse. A spokesperson for David Cameron said he was very saddened to learn of the fatalities and injuries and later both he and the Mayor of London, Boris Johnson, thanked the emergency services for their rapid and professional response. The crash happened close to a main railway line during this morning's rush hour and caused a lot of disruption, but all roads around the site and Vauxhall tube station have now reopened.